welcome back everyone for a uh, another episode on YouTube. And if you're <laughs> if you if you're not on not uh, here on Twitch with us, every time we break for an episode like that, we play something called Words on Stream, and there's just some hilarious stuff. We go, don't use M, folks, and then we continue typing in words with M's. It's, it's how we are. I call the fake letter, then use the fake letter. That's what I do every single time, Jimmy. It's crazy. I say it out loud, and then I ignore it. It's just how it is. Anyway, we're back at Satisfactory, where the current goal is that we need to make more stuff, because our our uh, steel production is down in the gutter. We need to increase that, for which we need to use the Mac for belt, which we've unlocked already. To use, to increase the production, we need more power, which we fixed in the previous YouTube episode and the previous segment on the stream. We still need to hook up these two coal generators and then we can make more steel. But why did we need more steel? We needed more steel because we need to make... What do we need to make? Oh, well, we need the space elevator parts, which all need steel. We need to make train lines that deliver steel we need oh, oh we oh we need so many things oh let's go ladies and gentlemen um okay well first things first we need to rejig the distribution do we need to rejig the distribution here um i think we do how does this wait a minute Excuse me. Something's off. One, two. Oh, this one's off. I see how it is. Okay, let's um let's do this. We're gonna need all the space in our inventory as possible. Or the we go let's maybe snip and then bleed bleed and snip does that work we're basically switching over to the the next array which video does that go to stream elements should you buy well wow I need to update that um, right. So I think that the way that this is gonna go is going to be- Hello? Who are you and- What the fuck is happening here? <laughs> Who are you and what have you done? Okay, there goes that. So what I want to do is I want to make sure that the mid wow, that the main ones get all the coal first. So we're probably going to put in a smart splitter at the end, and we're going to send the overflow to the fifteenth from both ends. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Right, clean slate, as it should be. So basically we're doing three here. Can we a splitter? Can go, I think we did it out here, yeah. And then we're gonna use the Mark 3s, Mark 2s. I'm gonna use Mark 3s. I like using the highest available belt because it just makes it that they back up quicker. Um, which isn't meaningful at all in the long run. It just helps a potential manifold later down the line um, do its thing quicker. And I'm all about that. Okay, so we do that. So that is for those three. And then one, two, three, four. It comes here. And then we hook this up to that. We hook that up to that. And then here, we bring this out like so, right? 
Sorry that I'm speedrunning this, because we just did it in the other side. It's fine. And this is why I don't like load balancing, by the way. Every time you modify the loadout, you need to modify the balancer. And that is not... I don't... I don't like that. So, it is what it is. Okay, so here... We're going to add in a smart splitter. Like so. And this is where the magic is going to happen. So right is going to be basically call. Ah, you know what? Let's just do... Let, 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 hiya. Let's just send call. And then center is going to be the overflow. There. So then we do this. And then we hook this up, and boom, that production becomes available already. And then here, whoa, 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 we're going to bring this along. And here, we're going to put in a measure. Right about here. And then we remove this guy, and then replace that guy. There. So now that's hooked up. So the overflow of coal that would, would eventually be making its way from over there is going to come over here. And do one, two. And go right in there. It's going to take a hot minute before this works it out, but... We have enough power without this fuel gen, so it's going to be fine. And then we're going to do the same thing back here. So we need to go and dismantle all the spaghetti that we have over here. Is that a smart splitter? No. For some reason it kind of looked like one. I was like, wait. Shouldn't be there. But the thing is that we're not going to touch this setup ever again. This is our final call generator array and I don't think that you need bigger. If you do need bigger, that usually means that you've miscalculated something probably mayhaps um all right so one two three And then this is for the middle one. One, two, three, four. And then this is a Mark IV to there. <clears throat> it's a Mark three there. Another splitter here. Can't afford! Hey! Okay, we're gonna use Mark 2 then. It really doesn't matter. Even a Mark 1 is enough here. Um, and then Mark 4 here. And then we put in our Smart Splitter over here. And then left is Call. I said left is Call. And then center is overflow. The only modification that we're going to do to this setup going forward is going to be upgrading this to Mark 5. And we'll be upgrading the inputs to Mark 5. Oh, come on, really? Something's off here. Oh, 
Oh, it's just on a different side. That's fine. So we're going to be upgrading the input to Mark V and therefore removing one of the coal miners from the equation. And this is only going to be running off of um, one miner. And that's it. You don't need more. One Mark III miner with Mark V belts bringing the coal here. And that is going to free up another pure node. And it's going to be awesome. Right. So we plug this up. This guy's ready, at least for the call. And the next thing that we need to do is probably put in the windows for the light. One more. One for the road. Yeah. <clears throat> Power storage. One's bringing out this way. Boom. So that's neat. Why are you red? Insert fuel. Oh shit, didn't I, <laughs> I didn't hook up the other end. Whoopsie. <laughs> that's okay. Okay. Good. 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 Everything's fine. Everything, everything's awesome. There we go. <laughs> right. Okay. So that's going. Oops. I didn't mean to. Um, let's go and see if this is backing up already. It looks like it is. Which means that our overflow should be overflowing. It is. Jolly good. Which only means one thing is that we need to hook up the water because that is not hooked up yet. Everything's normal. Yep. This is going to hurt me more than you. Here. 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 Kind of means that these go away. Made ramenish food again. Ooh, bring me some monk. Por favor. There. Perfection. I would if I could. I've said this on Discord the other night. Is um, I was watching a um, something. You can guess what I was watching, but um, there was a scene where uh, some of the cast was in Amsterdam, sitting at a bar outside, and. One of the guys stood up, you know, stumbled on the chair a bit as, oh, I'm a bit drunk, and then walked off. And it made me realize how much I miss that. How much I miss just sitting outside with a beer, with friends, enjoying the sun, and just, just chatting away. And then that's it. That, the simple things. I really miss that. No, it wasn't porn. It, <laughs> it wasn't porn. Okay, so that's that's kicking. Do I have enough? Yes. I answered my own question. I wanted to see if I have enough uh, AI limiters to make more smart splitters. And I do. Exactly, Zong. <laughs> For once, it wasn't porn, right?
Vampire Diaries is crack. I'm telling you. <laughs> you had to. Oh, you son of a bitch. Okay, hold on. Really? <laughs> okay, we're gonna deal th we'll deal with this from the bottom because if I deal with this from the top, then uh, I'll lose. I'll lose uh, my orientation. Well, we might as well do this then. So yeah, finishing that thought <laughs> is I really miss those simple things and I really wish that we were in a situation where we could organize a little European meetup uh, somewhere. I'm thinking that maybe the, the best place to meet up would probably be Germany because uh, that's like a central place for everyone. Um. Although I really don't miss flying into Berlin. Man, that is... I've done it so much. I've done it twice, twice, once or twice a week for a very long time and I, I hate it. Copenhagen? I do... Uh, that was the other one. Like, I really like Copenhagen. Um... Is there a new airport now? Ooh, now you're speaking my language. Very remote. Oh, fuck. Even more remote than Tegel? Tegel was almost Berlin center. Oh my good lord. <laughs> I I do I do like Copenhagen. You forgot to underclock the thank you zone. Remind me again once we go back down here. I'm kind of losing focus. Okay, okay, focus, 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 focus. Um I need this up here, otherwise things won't work. And I need this down here. There we go. I think the one thing that's missing is the smart splitter from here. Oh, nice. Yeah, we have uh, quite a few um, Danes as well here. Can I? That would that was that would have been too easy. 
Save the game. That's a good idea. Hold on, let's set this up. So left is going to be coal. And then the center is overflow. Now let's save the game. Yeah, I agree, Jimmy. We we need a good holiday. And Yeah. Unfortunately though, for me to comfortably do what I want to do, I do need to get back to work. Which I I'm I'll really need to do. I've been putting it off, but yeah, I can't put it off any longer. And I need to work at least a month or two, get paid, be comfy, and then everything's going to be fine. Music festivals, I haven't been to one in multiple years. Many, many multiple years. Where's the... There. So the thing with festivals with me that I've I've never went to a festival as audience, and I think we've discussed this a few times. Um, I've always worked on festivals in one way or another, um, either by you know going with artists as artists, or being a TV crew, or or things like that. Um, so for me, festivals is very. I don't know how to be audience. I I grew up in festival backstages, and I've never been as an just a general member of audience. Drink Trill, maybe see some shows. Yeah. Like, you know, like for me, um, festivals were always work. High stress and a lot of fun work. Um, so it's a weird, weird mindset to not have that. But I think uh, quite a lot of time passed since I've been to one. So uh, it should be okay. <clears throat> Just doing the drinking part? Yeah. That's kind of what I do with skiing. I love, I love going to the Dolomites in the Alps, it's one of my favorite spots to be, but on a week-long skiing trip, I maybe ski a day or two maximum, everything else is just, I'll go on foot, I'll go up, get a book, get for some few drinks, just sunbathe in the snow, which is awesome, and just have a really good time, you know, get kind of drunk up, up in the mountain. Meet some new people, then uh, show up at parties at the night. It's, it, it's a whole thing. Um, and skiing hungover is not fun. What are books? <laughs> All right, I think we're done. I think we're absolutely done with this. We got our uh, capacity and production at forty-one or forty-four is our production. I'm kind of tempted to disconnect the bio burners. I don't like the way that they interfere with our maximum production. Skiing's are, I love skiing as as the activity as well because it's awesome. Uh however, 
it's also dangerous. So out of the many times that I've been skiing, uh, either I've suffered injuries or the people I was with suffered injuries. I'm just too lazy for injuries, right? I'm not, I'm not that, uh, I'm not that tween anymore who, who goes down black slopes like a maniac. Um, why listening to Bloodhound's Gang, I Hope You Die? Because that was my thing. So I'm gonna hook that up. I like that it comes in extra, but I don't like that it screws up the numbers. Gonna do that, gonna do that. And then here's here's where we're gonna do a bypass. Um I'm gonna disconnect this. And then we're gonna disconnect this. And then we're gonna do a little bypass here. Missing quick wire. I can probably solve that issue. Oh, really, Enzgo? Nice. I've always had people injured, and 99.9999999% of the, uh, the times, it wasn't their fault. It was someone ramming into them, someone knocking them over. You know, all sorts of shit that happens on the road as well is when you're at the mercy of other people. There. So these are the true numbers. So we're making 4.4 gigawatts. Which I'm not technically happy about. How is that? Ah, oh, man. And this adds that extra. The capacity of 5 gigawatts. Yeah, and we can turn this off. There we go. And we can turn this on if we need it. Um, pum, 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 pum. They all have about a hundred. Yeah, we probably want to, you know what? Let's fill them up completely while we can just prepare for the worst. And then, oh, look at, oh, look at all that juicy gonna keep that for oh 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 okay we're gonna do a lot of oh look at that 18 medicinal inhalers this is my favorite recipe alien organs that you get a crap ton of from doggos and mycelia that you get a crap ton of from doggos um it's perfect hi zombie consti what's up Great. So let's put these back. Do, 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 do. And then we can go ahead and uh, grind down all of the alien carapaces just to have the solid biofuel. Yeah, that should be a thing. Oh, hey. Look at that. Uh, what are you? Alien carapace. Good. Eat. Was that all? I thought I picked up more. Okay, what are you? Are you the wood? You're the wood. And you're the leaves. I'll leave you with these. And would you do this for us? Thank you. 
Building a turbo fuel production line to power your mega factory. Nice. We're not there yet. <clears throat> oh, look at that screen space reflection, yo. Okay. We got power. And we needed to make... Oh, yeah. Which one did we... I don't think we rolled for this, did we? But we definitely need to make supercomputers. That's rough. We have 31. And we can't buy them. Thanks to the rules. Arr. You know what? This is not even bad. This is not bad at all. We need to make some more of the AI limiters. Three high-speed connectors. So we need 300 high-speed connectors. We definitely don't have that. Well, we do have a uh, we do have hard drive research if we roll it. Um, So basically, the only thing that we do not have enough of is the high-speed connectors, right? Oh, even the computers. Although we can go and find some more computers. Um, we can go and find some more computers around uh, drop pods. So let's put this back to... The high speed connector and then the circuit boards and quick wiring cables. So I think what we need to do is set up some automation. And we're gonna do that real quick. And then we're just gonna leave this here to tick while we're off doing other things. And by the time we finish, we might actually have what we need. So Let's go and delete that. Hit. <clears throat> Like so. Where is this here? Ba ba boom 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 boom. Very good. And then take that. Put one or two here, store all, store all, take this apart, throw this in, very good, store all, and let's go and get some materials. So what does it need? It needs... Does anyone remember re the recipe? It needs quick wire, it needs cables. But what else? Whoa. <laughs> I'm missing everything, aren't I? Circuit boards, thank you. So we need to go and get some circuit boards, which we should have a crap ton amount of. I need to run a quick ad break, guys. It's going to be 90 seconds. If you see an ad break, then uh, it'll be over in 90 seconds. Don't go anywhere. I'm not going to do anything extra. 
I'm just gonna go and pick up materials. Okay, circuit boards, and what was the other one? Eh. Okay, we'll need to kickstart this in. Cables, we got the cables. Cables, circuit boards, quick wire. And... Or is it just three? It might be a three-parter. Potatoes! No more? It's easy. Whee! AI limiters. No, no, we're, we're, um, we're not on, we're not for supercomputers. We're doing, um, high-speed connectors. Potatoes are used for everything, yeah. We really need to do some cable production up here because that's the one thing that we're not building up here which we use for building materials so we'll probably set that one up as well Whoa! did I do that alright you get that uh, cables. Let's go for cables. Yeah, we don't have any of the alts for it yet. We will. Yeah, our current goal is to upgrade every machinery or every area to be Mark IV. I don't see ads anymore on Twitch. I had my ad block disabled for the entire site, but still didn't see them. Interesting. I see them with or without ad blockers nowadays. I shouldn't come up here. I shouldn't come up here. It's fine. <clears throat> and once we upgrade the production of steel, we can reinstate the truck that is bringing steel over here. Um, or, you know what, we're probably going to replace it with trains. Oh, I don't have anything on me, do I? Wrong way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wasn't the way that I wanted to go. Okay. This is what we're going to raid. Thank you. I mean, that's a good thing. At least, you know, subscribing, it, like, it's an incentive to subscribe, right? To not see ads, which is nice. It's also an incentive to support the streamer, which is also nice. Um, but on the streamer side, as I've been saying, showing, like, the, the fact that I have to play ads is the stick, not the carrot. It is what it is. It works for them. Shut up. <laughs> that guy just barfs into our ears. Ear rape. You got turbo to not see ads? Yep. Put that in and then go for circuit boards. Now, that is going to be a trick. 
but we have to do it. If you haven't seen our plastic rubber setup yet, with the turbo, with the, the circuit boards, then uh, you're about to be amazed. Did you know that there is a recipe that uses coke coal and rubber to make circuit boards? It's awesome. Heading out for the day, Azim. Thanks for being here. I really appreciate it every single time. Have a good night, Azim. So, in a in early game, and I still consider plastic rubber early as the way that we've set it up, it's witchcraft. So, early game circuit board production is reusing the coke coal that people normally sink and making circuit boards out of them. Yeah, it's really, really nice. It's just a byproduct. Yeah, that's the nicest. I agree, Tobbs. We don't have the, the alt yet. Uh, so I was kind of sad that, oh my god, how are we going to make circuit boards if I don't have my favorite alt for them? And then we stumbled upon this recipe, which is really nice because otherwise we were just sinking the coke. And the we're not using the rubber, right? The rubber is just a backup be, in case we need it to build with. So by reusing the leftovers we can get a stable circuit board production going it's not something that i would plug into a full-blown automation it's a situational recipe as smirkin would say um but it's awesome it works when in the progress do you usually get hard drives right after i put down the hub day one Yeah, this is this is the the whole point of the challenge that you get to work with materials or recipes that you normally wouldn't and I love it. Look, all of this is circuit boards. Well, almost. Take all. Yeah, it's it's awesome. You know, it's just here it's just taking away on its own. Um it's not going anywhere. I'm not going to put it into production. Because in production, I do want to use the the silica one. Um, but just to have something to build from or build with, like what we're doing now, is awesome. Also, I would never in a million years do so much hand feeding. And I, I think it's going to be something that I do do. Because, you know, just making those um, high-speed connectors or making the supercomputers, we don't need to hook them up. Uh, just to build with and then once we need it for the automation we will make another um, production line for them properly but until we need that it's good yeah I think the next playthrough is going to be about trying to use recipes that I wouldn't use. I don't think that it's going to be a screw heavy, so that's a big decision to make. You can play the game with uh, as a screw heavy challenge. That might be torture more than I would love. But Steel coated plate. Yeah, I, I there's a bunch of recipes that I never go for because I don't think they're good um, And I do want to have a playthrough where I only use those Just to see how wrong I am Because they're probably good. They probably have their very Distinct upsides um, I just want to know what they are and I will never know if I never try <clears throat> they all got their use case. Yeah, yeah. I just, you know, un unless you use them, you'll never know when to use them. It's all like getting to know your toolbox, right? And this is the the weird thing that a lot of people comment on on YouTube videos, like, but why? 
I'm like, why not, right? Know the things that you can go to when you need to do something. No, no, no. <laughs> All right, well, uh... Exactly, it's all situational. Don't optimize the fun out of the game. Yup. Yeah, and that's that's my argument against a lot of uh, a lot of people who want this or that or the uh, what is it? The exosuit mod, right? It's like if you have the exosuit mod, the only way to play the game is with the exosuit on. Um. Oi, patch dropped with the cheat creep fixed? Hold on. Cheat creep has been unfixed. New bugs. <laughs> oh, bless their hearts. Oh, bless their hearts. I love that. It's the best patch note I've ever seen in my life. Um, if you are in, in our Discord, then go to Satisfactory, the, the Satisfactory channel, and that you can see the patch notes there. Um, new bugs. Cheat Crete TM has been unfixed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is awesome. This is awesome. Uh, <laughs> I love it. Okay, hold on. Let's read this. Um, fixed bug that prevented miners from being upgraded, downgraded. That is great. Don Raff, thank you for the follow. Um, tweaked hologram materials for better visibility. Fixed aluminium casings, having the wrong texture in conveyor belts. Potential fix for the no error message, crash and continue load. Fix light quality options, resetting every time the game was launched. Fix bug where the distance between drone station wouldn't be calculated properly. Okay, I'm not going to restart the game now. We'll do it in a break. Um... Yeah, no, I, I, the, the issue is I don't think they've understood the significance that Chikri had on building. Um, and this is the whole point of experimental. Like, we can have those discussions. We can change the way that they perceive things, and that's great. Right. Are we there yet? Can I start doing the thing? I think I can. So this is ticking away at its snail pace. I do want to upgrade this. Speaking of slugs, we're going to go and check the doggos because we need more power shards. <clears throat> if you want to adopt a lizard doggo, then uh, 500 biddies get you on the list. And uh, you can too have a doggo named after you. And we'll do that. Later today, I think, because we need to build a manufacturer that makes beacons, and we're going to make a stack of beacons, and then uh, pay back the debt, the naming debt. Guys, this is not what we agreed on. A very bad haul, everyone. Come on. Fess up. No. Who's hiding the slugs? I'm not going to be friends this way, guys. Not going to be friends. Okay, I'll get that. Okay, that's good too. We're not going to be friends. Let's continue the art installation up here. Eh. It's 
starting to look good. How do you... Oh, I'm at the wrong one. You guys are really not producing today, are you? What's wrong with you? <laughs> I know, right? My nose is so itchy. Okay, I got everything we need for Mark 4. So here's the plan. We're gonna go to the steel area. I need to refuel. We're gonna go to the steel area and turn on the Mark 4. And then we're also going to go to the quick wire, turn on the Mark IV. And then we're going to start upgrading everything. And then we do need to take care of the power situation. We need to set up. We need to set up the... Whatchamacallit. The fuel power. Because... Once we start upgrading everything, we're just going to be doubling our power usage. And we're going to be back to where we started today. Um, in terms of power requirement. I think it's perfect time to say if anyone's new here and not following the channel yet, make sure to follow and not miss out. Uh, you have to go get some sleep, work in the morning. All right, Nugs Cree, thanks for hanging out. I really appreciate it. Is it on Xbox? Unfortunately, not yet, Panda Man. I, I imagine it will be. They're focusing on actually making the game good before they focus on porting it to other platforms. Uh, which is fair enough. They don't want to get bogged down in uh, comp compatibility issues until they figure out what they want to have in the game. Need to get up at 5 a.m. tomorrow? No, Consti! That is illegal. Oh, shit. I do need more slugs. Three sixty. Oof. All right. Well, we might have to actually go slug hunting. Oh, come on. It's fine. Does someone remind me that when we get more slugs, we need to overclock these miners. Until then, we're going to go on a bit of a low rate. You won't have to do a lot, just need to be awake. Those are the worst, though. Yo, this is not merged yet. Let's merge it into one. It is, oh, interesting. It is merged into one, but you can't upgrade it as one. Or can you? Oh, you can. Oh, that's sneaky. Nice. I also realized why our math was off the other day when I couldn't figure out why we had the whole thing balanced for 260 and not 270 is because it's all balanced for a Mark V belt. Um, and until we get the Mark V belt, it's not going to make perfect sense. Upgrade that. We need to upgrade this and that and that. Upgrade this. And that, and that there. So that's the inputs taken care of. 
Yeah, yeah, that explains it. Because that, that's how we've built up this entire place. That once we have the Mark V belts, it'll all work out perfectly. Um, I just forgot about it. Missing encased in it already? No worries, we got more here, hopefully. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I do need a way up here. Can I do this? Do you believe in me? Aha. Wrong buttons. Pressing all the wrong buttons. So we do that. And then we need the output to be for as well. Now here's the issue. I don't think we've uh, connected up the rest, so we need to do that. Um, there goes that. And these guys. Oh, really? Son of a bitch. Why can't you just upgrade with the materials on it? Okay. Um, one more thing that we need to do here. It's kind of an interesting one, isn't it? We need to hook these up. And how high were you? That's a fiver, isn't it? Yeah, that's a fiver. Okay. With mergers. One, two. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two. Is that good enough? Hold on. I might be off. Well, I'm off with the spacing. Wow. One, one, two. There we go. Three, four, five. I really don't like the way that the smelters are. And this is off as well. My god. Okay, you know what? Fuck you. We're gonna have a one, two here. That's going to be our snapping line. And then we're just gonna do this. I don't know how I forgot to do this, to be honest. The whole plan was to not have to touch any of this when we upgrade the belts. Two, three, four, five. But here we are, touching it. What's your output? 55. Two, three, four, five. Actually, I can play video games if I want. I just need to be up. Dude, that is the perfect thing. Two, three, four, five. Three, four. Hold on. Two, three, four, five. That's what I loved about working from home in Ark. I used to do all the Ark breeding while I was working. Two, three, four, five. Five, because it's something that you need to pay attention to once an hour or so, which uh, makes it very convenient. Oh, hey, there's more. Three, four, five. Two, three, four, five.
So then... We need one here. One, two, three, four. Dismantle. Five. I don't think this will work the way I want it to work. So what we're going to do is probably put another one here. One, two, three, four, five, like that. Oh yeah, that will work. Because then we do that, and then we do that. Fantastic, and we need to set up this as well. But before we do that, let's go and upgrade this and upgrade that. Upgrade that, upgrade that. So now, if we go ahead and turn this puppy on. Need to increase the production of this and pull the Mark IV lever. Boom. So now what we should see is that this all starts bleeding out because we're not having, we're not putting in as much as we need to. This was something that I do recommend for everyone to do is we've built this entire platform balanced for Mark V belts and we were using switches to segment off the progression tiers. So now that we have the Mark IV inputs and the Mark IV outputs, we pull the lever and it turned on the next set of machines that will be balanced for that amount of input. And then we have that for Mark V as well. So you can see that these guys now all turned on um, and they're doing their output. And then these guys are still off because we don't have the required input output speed. But we're going to, I literally forgot to set this up though. So we're going to do that first. So the next time we have an upgrade, then we don't have to worry about it. Two, three, four, five. 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 There we go. Alt. Did I do something wrong? We go and then yeah that can work nice fantastic it's awesome this is really good to see that that is just chugging along we need to go and uh get some more slugs our lane's evil Bye, little truck. 
the other thing. Okay, so this is happening. There's still 8k in that. Do I care? Not yet. So this should have two sets on. Yes, it does. Very good. Why is that yellow? Why are you yellow? Why are you yellow? Oh, this is fine. It just needs some time. That's fine. This is balanced properly. Um, it's just manifolded, so it's gonna be a hot minute before this uh, this builds up. But it's fine. Okay, everything's working. We just need to go and uh, be able to upgrade all of these. I don't want. What did I? I saw something in the sky. I. I swear something was floating. Maybe not anymore. Who knows? Okay. It's GTF. Do we need anything? I'm gonna take more encased industrial beams. That's what I want to do. But for that, we need to be here. What in the God's name is this tune? Go away. I already had it. Hold on. I already had it downvoted. Why was it playing it? And Pretzel is acting up. <clears throat> right. What's next on the other uh, on the agenda? So this is going to kickstart our steel operation, but it's not enough. We need to I've started using the walkway snapping to make new types of design, but it might just give too many options. It started to make things overcomplicated. Yeah. Oh, shit. Might be time for trains, ladies and gentlemen. Might be time for trains. I'll tell you why. Because we have two outputs here, right? We have the steel plates and we have the steel pipes. And we're, we need both elsewhere. Oh, do we get these? Yeah, let's get this one, and there's one up top. Uh, we're gonna juice them down. Hey! Yeah. Alright, jumping puzzle it is. Hey! <clears throat> You're not enough space. Because I only need two more. Uh, there's one up there that I don't really want to touch because he's just his furniture by now But there should be more around here somewhere I know there's one there's one up there in gas, but I don't want to deal with that one. There should be one right here. Yeah Easily accessible bearing a few Hogs. Yes, you guys. Somewhere. I think it's time for trains. I don't know what I want to do with trains. What do you guys want to do with trains? We could... I definitely don't want to be... Do I build the bridge? 
I don't want to build that massive bridge again because it took us so much time for not that much of a purpose aside from it looking cool. I definitely want to do the double track layout because it's always fun. It inspires people, which I like. But I definitely don't want to spend river route, no bridge. Well, that's that's a different thing. That's um, the river route is for the fuel. We're not. I'm not talking about that one, right? I'm right now. I'm talking about. Oh, come on. Right now, we need to carry this steel over to other parts of our factory. And in general, like, even we do the river route, I think I'm just gonna go very bare bones. Try and make it quick. We're gonna figure out a, a quick way of doing it. We're definitely not gonna do the power poles, because that eats up a lot of time. Oh shit, I can't handcraft. Don't mind me. I almost did! Yeah, we're gonna do a monorail style, but with with two tracks. Um, just because I prefer the two tracks more, I don't like seeing um, different direction trains. And I promise that in this playthrough, we're going to optimize so that no train passes a train station unless it has to stop at that train station. So that is another thing that we need to worry about. There we go. So that's up and running. <sighs> Following the terrain, I've done that a few times. I'm not a huge fan. I love the way that it looks. It's just super frustrating to build. I don't want to be frustrated during streams. Also, it's not as inspiring um, for a trained newbie to see. Yeah, but I do care about clipping. That's the issue. <laughs> it's, it's really frustrating. Until we can influence the way that the spline goes before placing it down, I don't think I'm ever going to do terrain again. Uh, that said, we can still build close as possible to the terrain with uh, with foundations and whatnot. Yeah, I think so. I think most of the regulars here care about clipping too. And it's completely fine. Right, is there anything else that you guys think we need to upgrade before we move on. I think one of the things that we might need to upgrade is the quick wire because we need to have backup quick wire every single time that fucking rock. It's not even loaded in, but the hitbox messes me up. I'm gonna put a ramp over it or something.
Are we gonna do something nice? I do want a cliffside train again. It's super annoying to make, but it looks cool. The reason why it's super annoying to make is because you can't m modify the spline while building. And in order to make it follow the cliffside, you have to do a lot of jiggery pokery. Just use the factory cart to do all your transportation. Oh, that's a good idea. We've done that a few times. At least I like doing that for, for doggo waste. We might need to do that soon. Anyway, uh, let's go and upgrade the quick wire. Now we're gonna go and uh, empty the doggos again. See if we get some purple slugs or something. Because I think in order to properly upgrade the quick wire, we need more slugs. You know what? This has been bothering me. There we go. We had a playthrough where I had nine, more than 90 factory cuts automated. <laughs> Alright, let's actually turn on the Mark IV. Boom! Hi, Rifa! Zip, and then we'll see how far we need to take this because it needs to be Mark 4 until then, and it can be Mark 3 afterwards. Yeah, we're just gonna do eh, why not? I think this should be enough. Oh, we're just gonna upgrade all. Yeah, I'm just gonna upgrade it all. Never mind. That. And we need to upgrade the outputs. We'll deal with that in a minute. Um, this is the next thing that we need to deal with. Where's the where's the final output? It's on this end, isn't it? There we go. There we go. Very good. Let's go deal with this. Dee -dee 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 So, we don't need this throughput yet. In order to need this throughput, we would need to upgrade the incoming um, other stuff too. Which we haven't done yet. But, eventually we will. So this is going to be prepared for that. Uh, if we need more than 50 motors a minute, which uh, I don't doubt it. <laughs> Look at that, 2400 motors sitting right there with uh, 50 a minute motors coming in. So, 
I think we're okay. I think we're actually okay. I'm just gonna remove these, remove that. Take out away that, take away that. I don't need these guys. I just wanna fill up on motors and take them back home. Don't need these, don't need these. There we go. I don't actually need this either or that. Fantastic. There. Start, start doing your thing. Nice. Things are chugging along. This is what I like to see. Oh, very nice. That is coming along nicely. Beautiful, beautiful. This is something that I do need to upgrade. Uh, I don't have slugs, so let's go and pat the doggos. Hopefully they've uh, been cooled off. And then, how are we doing in recording time? What is going to be our next challenge? Do we? Do we, do we, do? Where are you? Do we make a build train? Is it time? Is it time? Do I even have enough? Do I even have enough space? And materials. What do you need? Them computer requirements though. And the heavy modular frames. Yeah, I say that's a no. It's fine. Okay. I'm not gonna make a build train yet. How are you cracking? 58. What are you needing? Modular frames. I'll feed you modular frames in a minute. And there's motors everywhere. My god. <laughs> Modular frames. Let's go and get some. Yeah. How are we going to get... We, uh, we need so many slugs. We need the doggos to start producing. Because we need... At least like 120 slugs or something. Or not slugs, power shards. Um. If not more. Probably more. All right, start churning this out. Good. You're still good. You're still good. You're still good. Okay, everything's good. Uh, you've been busy. 276. You're still making shit? Uh-huh. Quick while it goes quick, isn't it? Okay, anything here? No. All right. Let's go doggo time. do 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 Hi. You guys need to start producing because my entire strategy depends on you. Otherwise, we have to go and pick up every single slug on the way. Which we could do. It's just a lot of slugs. You know what? Let's unlock the gas mask. And once we unlock the gas mask, we can go into some caves, uh, pick up the big boys. As in the caves where there's like 10, 20 slugs lying around. All together, not individually. And then also, oh shit, also the fuel generators need 
computers too, don't they? Oh man. Ay, 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 caramba. Do we actually do the computer automation first? Because these guys aren't budging. What do you think? Do we do the computer automation? How many computers does this need? Five per. It's 200 computers that we don't have. Where did my computers go? We probably used it up for research, didn't we? Oh. Okay. And we don't have good alts for computers either. I don't think. Yup. Them not the good alts. We have the circuit boards down, the crystal oscillator. Oh, uh, yeah. We could work with that. It's not too bad. Even that, I do like the normal recipe, the standard. It's pretty, pretty all right. Hi, yeah. Uh, We could hand feed this as well. Yeah, we need to set something up for this. Right, can someone do roll three, please? If it's number one, then we can do another hard drive. Let's let's hope it's a number one. Roll three, exclamation point, roll three, no spaces. Uh, Yama, thank you. <clears throat> let's hope that this is the hard drive that we're looking for. Let's go and unlock the gas mask, shall we? Don't think I have enough rubber on me. We might need to take a trip to the rubber parts. Also, <clears throat> ooh, ooh, ooh. I kind of want to do that. Oh, because that we're gonna. Shall we do that? Shall we set up the synthetic fabric from the get go? I don't feel like we should. It might as well. No? Okay, so here's the plan scratch, scratch, scratch whatever we said <laughs> until now. Um. Yeah, I, I do want to set up a massive computer. The thing is that in order to set up computer manufacturing, you need power. In order to set up power, we need computers. So we're going to set up a, a very small scale computer uh, manufacturing that is going to only make computers that we use for hand, well, hand not handcrafting, but for a build train, for example, um, that we use for trains and train stations and whatnot. We're going to set up a, a small version of that. And then once we have enough power, we're going to set up the proper productions that are involved in automation and whatever. Because that's kind of what we were doing. Like this area here, this whole whole thing here, these two are not involved in any automation. This is only making stuff that we need for building. All right? These are our building mat generator platforms, uh, which we need to figure out how to put on a train, by the way, eventually. Um, but I think what we're going to do with these basic materials is that we're going to have a train station down here over the lake and we're just going to belt them down. Hi, Memrex! Um, so we're going to do that with the trains. Well, with the computers as well. We're doing that with the rubber. We're doing that with the plastic. We're doing that with the circuit boards. And I think that that is exactly where we're going to do it. The the fabric 
and therefore the gas mask and the iodine filter manufacturing there as well. And as we've learned in the previous playthrough, you only need one manufacturer chugging along. It's not a high requirement. But that kind of means that we need to plan ahead and figure out what we're going to do. So let's do that. So we know that we're going to need a few water extractors. I think two's going to be enough. Um, we're going to need a few refineries. How much did we have previously? Five? Let's go with five. Uh, we don't need a lot. We're going to have to have an oil extractor. And then we're going to have, depending on how many... What are we going to do with this? Oh... Now here's the unfortunate thing. Let's, let's put down 10, so 15 altogether. We're going to put this in an impure node. We're playing toss salad with grilled chicken for the... I die. Give it to me, Arblane. We're going to put this in an impure node because if we put it on a pure node, I'm going to go overboard and start dealing with things. Now, we need a, a way to take care of the heavy oil residue that is the output of it. Now, is there anything creative that we can do with that? Um... Can it not show me... <laughs> Phoenix Dowdy, thank you for the follow. Does anyone know of a good... good way to use... leftover heavy oil residue? We could convert it into coke. And we could make some extra steel out of it. My day's going great. Or fuel. I don't want to make fuel out of it because... Or do I? What if we have a self-powered fabric station? Huh? I've been dreaming about this game. Is it worth it? Short answer, yes. Long answer? Do I... Do we even... Hold on. I don't think we have... Do I have a command for it? That's... That's not it, Arblane. Um... I might. Give me a minute. Here. That answers your question. <laughs> that video. Um. Is there a lot to do? <laughs> Currently, I'm a bit over 3,000 hours in the game. Um, it doesn't get boring at all. Uh, you'll need, you need the Coke later to make aluminium. That's, that's difficult. We'll sort that. Um, and you don't necessarily need Coke with the right old recipes. Um, <clears throat> right. Okay. Let's make a self-powered Fabric, gas mask, whatever. Single playthrough, 300 hours is... Yeah. Yeah, 300 hours of playthrough is kind of... Kind of the average, I think, and it's pretty okay. Um... I don't know how many we're gonna need. Let's, let's go... F oh, that's way too much. Um... Let's make a few of these. We're just gonna play with this, right? This is completely bollocks. Um, a few of these. Th this is because just because we can. 
the only reason why we're making this is because we can. And it's a different way of doing it. And I like that. Okay. Uh, we're going to need some motors. We're going to need some uh, rotors. Which we do have somewhere. If not here, then elsewhere. Um, pa -pum -pum -pum. Some of these guys. No desk drop. Oh, nice. I I haven't had any crashes with any of these lady, the patches lately. Oh, hey. A shopping list is a bit bigger. Hold on. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, staters. Didn't I have staters somewhere? We are making staters elsewhere as well. We can pick it up. But didn't... Why do I feel like we had staters here somewhere? Well, apparently not. We're gonna bring the coal, the... <laughs> concrete last. Yeah, yeah, we have a bunch of stators. Like, we're making stators for motors, so that's fine. I was just hoping that we have some lying around uh, that we can use. Apparently not. That's fine. Uh, we used it all up in the um, batteries up there. Whoa! That w I didn't think I had that much space. Uh, we don't need that much concrete. We do need a lot, but not that much. You check the Explorer? Not yet. Uh, no staters. That's fine. The MAM is ready. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. please be good. <clears throat> oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, ho, ho, ho. someone do a roll three, please. Crazy. Whoa, oh, my God. What crazy? You had one job. <laughs> Hi, Eugene. Reroll? No, no, we're not. That's not. No, that's illegal. Um, now we need a roll three in order to decide between hard drives and these two. Someone do a roll three, please. Number three for Zong. Well, there goes. There goes that. We need 50 super computers. Uh, I don't think... We might be able to... F Hold on. Does I'm just checking my list of how many supercomputers can we get from loot. 55 altogether. I think we've used up a few in research already, haven't we? Have you not? Ooh. What? What do you know about Eugene? Ay, 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 ay. We might be able to get some. So I got 31 there. Yeah, we'll need to check the 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 calculator to see if we've we've picked up there's one where there's 15 together. If we haven't picked that one up, we might go there. All right, let's see which one that is. Uh, it's the one that requires quantum computers to be opened. Does anyone know which one that is? Hold on, let's go and uh, find the calculator. Is 
Is that the one in the swamp? Hi, Cabalance. If it's the East Swamp, then that's good because then we can. Then we can do it. Come on. I said fog of war on. There we go. Uh, ta -ta 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 -ta. Yeah? No. Up here? No. Hold, please. That no, no, that's not the swamp, or is it? It is, Master. I don't care about the drive, I care about what you can loot around it. Um, pum 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 pum. There it is. Okay, how many is that? That's 11. That is still not enough. Panacotta, hello! Welcome on in. I think we've picked the one up that had supercomputers already. Hello? Was zip or they moved them around? They might have, okay. I've got I've got um, coordinates negative thirty five negative three thousand five hundred positive sixty three. Um, pum 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 pum. Hold please. Negative 3,000, positive 63, this one, right here. One supercomputer. Yeah, we've collected this already. Um, or quantum computer, yep. Welcome, welcome, welcome! Yeah, we're looking for quantum computers. But I picked up the 11 from here, or the 15 from here. That's the issue. Uh, that was the biggest batch altogether, and we need more. There's two 11s. We might go for them, but right now, let's just focus on what we needed to do, which is, I don't know what, I've lost my train of thought. Oh, we're going to build the, the fabric stuff. I could make it. It just takes a long time. We don't have computers for them, so we would need to set up computers. Um, I'd rather go and... Uh, and collect them, because we can. It's the quickest way out. Computers! Yeah. We're getting there. We're soon to set up our computer manufacturing. I mean, if any of you guys are a uh, mo 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 modded players, then definitely go and uh, check out Panacotta because he's streaming his uh, adventures with modding satisfactory. Can you get run over by a train in satisfactory? No, not yet. So we're missing an Ada, that helps. 
Because there's, I think there is one where there's, hey, 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 shit! God damn it! We need to retame the doggos. Well, <laughs> rip, rip. Press F. Yep. Thank you, everyone. Thanks for the support. Yo. Much appreciated. All the respect. Oh, where did he go? Hello? Hello? There it is. Oh, obviously. Well. Where'd the blooming egg... Oh, it's back here, isn't it? Yeah, I'll... duh. How many times do we need to retame these bloody doggos again? There we go. For 500 biddies, you can adopt a lizard doggo. Uh, they, uh, there's uh, quite a few currently that is unadopted. All right, but first, let's go and get the staters. Where are we going to get the staters from? Hi! Oh, shit. Let's not die here. There are the motors, which means that our staters... Oh, they're not even backing up. Uh-oh. Are we not? Yeah, that's enough. <clears throat> All right, well, it's time to do the doggos. Gaggy God, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in, everyone. Yo. It's nice to have you all here. If you're not following yet, consider following Gaggy God's uh, example. Much appreciated. I need to take as much as I can from here. The deal is 500. Take it or leave it. Are we going to go and retain them because we need their output? We need about 120 or more power shards. Because in this playthrough, for the first time ever, I am overclocking generators. And for the fuel generators, that's going to be a lot. But no need to leave. Oh, I need berries. But if one person gets a discount, everyone needs to get a discount. We might we might have a doggo discount stream once. All right, guys, you better start producing this time around. Very good. That is not a good start. Did you not get tamed? Are you not tame? Or are you just fucking with me? Yeah, it's it's very handy to see which one eats. Um, it's much easier to do this retaming.
No, I need both. Thank you. <laughs> it's 500 biddies. Yeah, um, the Twitch and unfortunately some laws in different countries are very, very, very stingy about using subscriptions for all sorts of in-game or whatever. Cost. Actually, the raffle is the worst, to be honest. Oh, there we go. Yellow slug. Very nice. But yeah, the issue with uh, with subs and doggos is that you can have, you know, a massive hype train. With 100 people subbing instantly, and then what? <laughs> I don't like the doggos anyway. In game NFT, exactly. Got you. Got you. Yo, stop eating my berries. What's, what's up with that guy? That guy's just peacing out. Did you actually accidentally eat, eat that green? There we go. Well, hey, at least we got a yellow slug out of it. <laughs> Ansga. <clears throat> How are we doing? Right, so back to where we were. Um, pum -pum -pum -pum. Mobile loot boxes, yep. Do I have everything in the build menu? Rotors, I don't think, oh, I'm so happy that I checked. Because obviously we're going to need materials for Bloomin pipes and belts and everything. God, I hate allergies. Oh, Blaine, go and eat. Thank you, Zong. <clears throat> Let's go and get some rotors. Whoever invented allergies, they can just go and suck a wiener. Really, game? Really? I was... I should have got that. <laughs> Eugene! Oh, you're lucky. I, I didn't have any allergies until I was 22. And then suddenly I started becoming allergic to cats. And then I think with that developing, that enhanced all the others as well. That was crazy. Right, kind of need one more shard, but we'll, we'll 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 be fine. Let's go on an adventure.
This is gonna be interesting. We're gonna have a factory that's not gonna be connected to our power grid. It's gonna generate its own power just because we need to deal with the waste. And I think we can do it. Hey, Thug Noop, what's up? I've never done anything like that before. So I'm super excited. Excited. <clears throat> I'm doing great. I'm having a blast tonight. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm having an absolute blast. I love doing things that I've never done before. I think we can squeeze enough power out of it. We'll just need to be super careful of how many what we put where. You're allergic to cats because they're, uh, yep. Prefer dogs? Yeah, me too. What's the point of losing hair too? <laughs> so we're gonna do two things. One is we're going for the furthest node, which we know is an impure node. Oh, uh, we're gonna tap that. And the reason being is because this guy is far enough away so that it wouldn't really be loaded in at the same time as the other one. So we're just distributing load on the on the server. Not the server? What am I talking about? On, on the save. So we're going to have an oil extractor sitting... Yeah. That looks actually good. Can I? Obviously, I can't do that. But we can do what we did previously, can't we? And I might as well do do it like this. Oh, hold on. Can we or can we not? Okay. Just gonna make it bigger. We have all the space in the world. I'm really excited about this build. I don't know why. Like, suddenly it's like, yes. Something unique, something cool, something that people don't do often. All of those things appeal to me. Aha! Oh, yeah, no, no, don't worry about it, Eugene. Oof, we can't do that. Okay, that's fine. And then... Let's see where we can put this. I would love to be able to put it there. Can I... Let's do that. <clears throat> that works. Sweet! Let's uh, pave the land. So how is this going to look? We're going to have a few refineries. So how much are you going to be outputting? Um, 60 per minute. Unless... We make some shards for you. Which is going to be a... <laughs> so that we're playing a challenge. If you've joined re recently and you don't know, A, my name is Meza. Welcome here. If you're not following yet, then please follow. Uh, we're playing a challenge where I cannot handcraft. It's against the rules. So 
the way that we can make power shards right now, Nathan, thank you for the follow, is by doing this. Oh no, I've actually juiced it down back. I'm an idiot. Yeah, sarc sarcasm is something that very that doesn't translate well uh, in text. So if you add in kappa signs or or emotes, that helps a lot. Or just a slash s at the end. Um, yeah, I'm curious. We need to keep a. We need to keep a. Can someone? Okay, so this is gonna use forty megawatts. Okay, and 120. So let's build out. Let's build out the thing, and then let's see what we can do with it. Because I think if we go and underclock shit, then it's going to help a lot. So we're going to overclock the extractor so that we get a lot, well, the most out of it. I think Mezzi's handsome. Yeah, there's there's the kappa. No. You know, there's, there's a very good... Four sims. You can do three sims. You can even have some vanilla two sims. And then you have handsome. Uh, what am I looking for? Refinery. Right. So this guy... will be making resin. And it needs 60 crude oil a minute. What if we only want 30 from it, right? So then we need two of these. For 60, and then four of these for 120. So that's going to be 30 megawatts. 60 megawatts. Is this the true number? Hold on. No, it's before the down clock. So we don't know, but it's going to be somewhere around 20 megawatts, maybe. But let's, let's go with 100%. So that is 120 megawatts. Okay. So it's going to be producing 20, 40, 40 heavy oil residue a minute and way too much polymer resin. So we're going to flip this. We're going to make more heavy oil residue. We don't need that much fabric. We really don't mean they need that much fabric. Um... And, you know, we could we could flip this if we wanted to. There we go. So that means that this is going to be producing 80, 160 heavy oil residue a minute, which is good. So let's do this here. Wow! Shit. Hello. So what did I say? 120 heavy oil residue a minute. Okay. Uh, let's say that that comes out here. Zong, let me figure this out, please. I'll ask for help when I need it. Okay, you should know by now. You remove the element of the puzzle that I enjoy in this game if you do that. Um. Uh, 
All right, there we go. So it's going to be outputting resin and it's going to be outputting heavy or residue. Heavy or residue is going to go down to Coke. Coke is going to go into generators which need water and the fabric needs water too. Now the question is, can we get away with water extractors? Where are we going to put our water extractors? That is a that is going to be a big defining factor. And I think Can we put them here? Yeah, I wouldn't. I decided not to. Okay, I can put my, them here. Can I put them all around here? It looks like it's not Oh, come on. I you Okay. Suck it. <laughs> okay, cool. Cause this looks like it's it's not deep enough, right? But apparently it is. You can you can put whatever you want here. Sweet. So that means I want to switch these around and have the coke machine here. So this is going to be petroleum coke. 40 a minute. We got 120. So what if we do 50% and have six? One, two, three. Four, five, six. That's sixty a minute. So that's one twenty, two forty, three hundred cook a minute. Why do you underclock rather than just build three? It uses less power. Significant the the power requirements with under and overclocking is not linear. So having three of these uses more power than having six underclocked to 50%. We're trying to use the least amount of uh, power while keeping our sanity. Oh my god. <clears throat> also, I just realized that we didn't actually line these up. Two. Three, four, five, six. Yes, they did, Soggy Socks. I'm so happy. Uh, I'm going to download the patch while uh, the next break is on because... We want to use cheat crate. Right. Uh, I'm going to do something that I don't often do. We're going to do the solid output on top. One, two. I always do the <clears throat> solid on the bottom, but right now I want the, it's going to be easier with the pipes if they are on the ground. Wow. This is going to be fine. It's going to trigger a chat and I'm going to have fun with it. <clears throat> Sip of water, shoeless. It's a good shout. Cheers, everyone. Grab your waters and drink with me. <clears throat> yeah, 
Cheat Creed is awesome. Uh, you don't know you need it until you need it. I need way more slugs. I want to overclock these uh, generators that we're going to put in here. Oh, we're going to go on a slug hunt in the beginning of the next section. <clears throat> whoa, 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 whoa. go nice and easy <clears throat> and then we're going to set the flow just in case because we can that way <clears throat> and then I do have enough to set it here God dang it. <coughs> what was the requirement? 40, 20 a minute. <clears throat> Why doesn't copy paste work here? I mean, it works, but you have to press enter as well. And that is annoying. Right. Okay. So here's my next theoretical or hypothetical question from myself is how much coal does or coke To the wiki! Petroleum coke. Uh, 25 a minute. <clears throat> right. And we got 300. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. To the wiki! You no, know, we need to go and get some slugs. Work at a super hang register register, love the, to screw over people. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, so we get that. That's one thing. And then how much of this are we getting? How much of the polymer? Uh, one sock on. <laughs> Count in change. Thank you for the follow. Uh, so we're getting 20. <clears throat> Is this the updated already? Hold please. Did I fuck up? I hate the fact that this doesn't update instantly. I fucked up, didn't I? I did. God damn it. You know what? It's gonna be enough. One, two, three, four. 
60. So that means that we can remove this. There. Problem fixed. <laughs> oh boy. <clears throat> We definitely need to go slug hunting though. Can't can't put it off because we need it for efficient power generation. There we go. The cool thing about this setup is that the coal generators will consume at a hundred percent rate. So if we make enough coal generators to sink all the coke coal that we're producing, then we're good. We're always going to have production until the fiber fills up, which we could then sink, which is also good. Right. Okay. We're counting this. So 80 in total. Yeah. So that would mean that's it. <clears throat> that's it. It's the perfect number. Eh, why not? In it. There we go. There's that. <clears throat> needs 50 water a minute. We can grab that from here. And the way that we're going to do it is just pop it here. Ah, uh, ta ta ta. Let's do it like that. Wrong button. There we go. Look at that. <clears throat> it's working out nicely. And then we need 50 of that. Let's do 42%. Let's round it up. No need for a... No need for a, 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 a pump. Oh, output. Oh, shit. Hey. We're gonna go and put in a smart splitter here. It's a bit pushing it. Not gonna lie. It's a bit pushing it. There we go. <clears throat> Can I put an thing up here? Uh huh. Uh huh. I see. Let's just put it there. There we go. Is this in the middle? This is in the middle. That's not in the middle. It's fine. <clears throat> Do that, and then we're gonna have a sink here, a sinking feeling.
like that. Very good. Hey, we're doing things! And then the left is gonna be overflow. And then that side of the equation is pretty much done and dusted. Actually. That's pretty cool. Nice! Hey! Things are happening! Okay. <clears throat> so this is the output. Let's um let's put these guys in before it's too late. Wrong button. <clears throat> Doing it, Meza is doing progress, guys. This is awesome. Can we bring this anywhere but okay? It no, hey, hey, I feel like doing the Rasputin dance. This is why I always take the uh solids on the bottom because it works better with the power poles. Now I remember, it's fine. <clears throat> There's that, and then we can have it all trolling in the deep, or not. Whoa, 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 whoa. We'll just bring it around here. There we go. That's pretty much everything hooked up. So I need one more slug. Because I want to know, would you be my girl? I want to know. How much Coke coal a fully upgraded generator takes. And my way of figuring that out is going to be with empirical data. We're going to plug one in and see what happens. I see. I see a slug right there. Probably going to have to fight for it. I hear you. Eh. Hi. God dang it. How's the power pole lag? Oh. <laughs> Let me tell you, it's horrible. Never build power poles. My God. <clears throat> That's the other one that I get on... Uh, on uh, video comments. Is I don't agree with having a single power pole per machine because it causes a lot of lag and the object count and the... Wah! My God. I've never even come close to the object limit and we always end up with mega bases. Seriously, yeah, yeah, it's crazy. Um, let's do that. <clears throat> and then we need to go and grab some coke. That'll do. Sip of water for everyone from Monk. Guys, grab your drinks and let's have a sip. Right. 
<clears throat> so we're gonna put this guy here. Right, that very good placement, Meza. Good job. You did exactly what you wanted to do. That guy there. Auto save. Not deep enough. Your mother is not deep enough. God dang it. This place where the water isn't water and then the water here is water. I'm just going to do this because I want to have access to it. Uh, just do that. Do... Hello. Do that. I need power from somewhere. You! I choose you. Thank you. I don't care about the water at this point. <clears throat> I want this to fill up though. Oh, we need to put... There. Alright, so that's producing water. I need to put three of these in, which is going to do 91 water, which is nice. And then we need to figure out how many Coke call a minute we need for this. But we're going to do this after a break. We're going to be playing words on stream. So stick around if you're here on Twitch with us. If you're on YouTube, then uh, thanks for watching. Hit like and subscribe. And we'll be back with the next episode tomorrow. And if you're here on Twitch, just wait for 10 minutes and play words on stream. And then we'll be right back. And if you're not following yet, make sure to follow.